started? Mm -hmm. Rick, come on, you want to get started? Come on, sit over here. You want to sit beside me? You have to do all the mixing. You have to help me. Oh, okay, well, will I do it on my own then? I said, I have to do this on my own. Welcome, everybody, to this, uh, today's activity, which is, Leona, what is it? We want to make cloud play-doh and um, so we are going to um, do a lot of mixing today aren't we Lola? Yeah. So I hope you are all keeping well and I hope you enjoyed uh, Monday's activity with Kate, the fine motor activities and then we had yesterday we had Alicia and she done all the, or sorry that's tomorrow, <laughs> we had uh, Shelf and she did um, some water painting, so hope you all enjoyed that. Um, I did. We we we're going to get stuck in and do it today. We didn't get a chance to do it yesterday, so we're going to do some of it today. Yay! You said hello to everybody. Hello. Hello. Right, you sit here beside me, and you're going to be my helper, aren't you? Hello. Everybody, this is Leona, and she's my assistant, aren't you? Going to help me do lots of mixing. All right, sit over here, please. My assistant over this way. Oh, we have to bring Mr. Giraffe with us. So, I hope you're all keeping well and enjoying this quality time with your little ones. And hello to all my little learners. I hope you're all tuning in. And all the little learners across the year. There you go. Back up. I don't know where I left off. I just I was stuck going from where you were. Like Play Doh. All right, okay. Sorry everyone, we got cut off there, I don't know what happened. Um, so, as we said, we're going to make some cloud play-doh. So, Leona, what is in cloud play-doh? Do you remember? Do you remember what's in cloud play-doh? So, this is something very unusual. Um, it's, well, it's very different. Um, so, it's a bit like play-doh, only it's a different texture and it's actually really Mommy, easy to make. It's a lovely heart, Mummy. It's a lovely heart. So in our Clyde Play-Doh, what do we remember, have? Mommy, remember the other day we were looking for the other wee heart and this is the other wee heart. We found it. We found yeah. the other wee heart. We were looking for that yesterday. Yeah. Oh, we found it. That's brilliant. Mm. Um, yes, so what do we have on Clyde Play-Doh? What's this? Mm, salt. Oh no, it's not. Well, yes, salt goes into normal Play-Doh, so that's good, but this is conditioner. Uh. So. It's just ordinary hair conditioner and I got this one for a pound in metal and then we have some corn flour again this was like just under a pound by the little little's one of my favorite st shops by the way to get all my little learners stock it's probably one of the cheapest as well over here and then we have some food coloring you can use the gel or I also use um, I'm not quite sure if you can see it, but it's like powdered paint. Um, or you can actually use the colour, um, your cloud play-doh. You can actually use some coloured chalk and just chalk a wee bit in. Um, just, sorry, grate a wee bit of the chalk in. And that'll give it the same sort of effect of a bit of a colour. If not, it's nice as it is. And this smells like coconut, this conditioner, so it's lovely. Now, you only going to come and help me stir some, do some mixing this morning. Right, so we put in one part conditioner. So I use one of these cup measuring cups, but if you don't have one of these at home, it's fine just to use like an ordinary cup, a mug, a glass, anything. And it, as long as it's. <laughs> don't say that, no, that's not nice. You, you use one part conditioner and then two parts corn flour. So you can make whatever size quantity you want, as long as it's one part conditioner and two parts corn flour. Okay, so you want to come over and help me do some mixing, Leona? Or am I going to do this on my own? You want to, right? You get the wooden spoon. Wooden spoon to the ready. You hold the wooden spoon. Oh, you want to squirt that in? Right, you squirt it in. Okay. Oh, I'll shake it a wee bit till we get it. Uh oh. Right. It's okay, you're doing it. I'm just helping. Oh! 
Oh, watch make sure. <laughs> right, do you want to squirt it another wee bit? Hold that. One last go. So. Oh, right, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Oh, do you? I'm not feeling. Right, do you want to scoop it in? Yeah. Use the, use, yeah. Oh. Oh, it's really heavy. All right, right I'll hold this and you scoop, <laughs> you scoop it all out. Yeah. There, there's lots in the bottom there. You just keep scooping it all out. I'll give it a shake, try and get it all out. So, as I say, this conditioner, it's only like a pound. And this should do, if you're making it, um, if you're using one cup, you should get about two cups or so of conditioner out of this. Um, so, we're not done yet. Um, so, it'll last, you should get two goes out of it. Right, come on, we'll have to do the we'll have to do the corn flour. Corn flour. Right, are you ready to do some mixing? Are you ready? Have you got your spoon? Oh, we need to do the food colouring. That's right. So will we use powder paint? So powder paint or chalk or food colouring, whatever you've got. So just put enough in just to give it a bit of a colour. You don't need loads, like just a wee bit. There we go. You can all see that. So that's the powder paint and the conditioner. And Leona is going to do some mixing now. Yeah. Mixing. Mixing. Well, sorry, we're making wheat on you. Will I do it then? Um, I'm going to do it with the mini spoon. You do it with the mini spoon, okay? That sounds good. Mm. Right. Let's get mixing. Let's get mixing. Mixing. We are mixing together. Mixing, mixing, mixing. We are mixing. We are mixing. We are mixing. Everybody. We are mixing. We are mixing. Everybody. Yay! That was a lovely song. Are we all done mixing then? Yep. Nearly done. Get in our big, oh, really fast, hold the ball, don't forget to hold the ball, really fast, really fast, really fast, yay! This is even great just to develop their fine motor and just to practice lots of mixing. Yeah, Get your hands mix. all warmed up, okay? So, oh, I got some of mine. Oh, it's okay. Can we take it? Yeah. Here, use that to put in your hand if you want. So, with that all mixed up, that looks great, Leona. Well done. So now we're going to add in our corn flour. And this conditioner just smells lovely. It's so nice to make. So nice. Isn't it so nice? Yeah. Right. Mama, you always wipe it on your trousers. Oh, do I always wipe up my trousers? That's just because sometimes I haven't got the torn hand in. And I'll just wipe it on my trousers. Sure, they're going to go in the wash anyway, aren't they? We always get messy at Little Learners, but Little Learners is also about developing other important skills. What else do we learn? Fine motor skills. Yes, my And we learn how to do our writing. No, you're not. Right, you want to put this one in? Or will I put it in and you do the next one? Okay. Wow, well done. Right, next one. Okay. some of this out. Make sure we get all the corn flour in. Yeah. You want your spoon cleaned? Yeah, because it's a bit too messy. <laughs> it's a bit too messy? Yeah, it's too messy. Right, wait a wee second. Okay, there we go. Leon's ready to do that mixing. So mix, 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 mix. So if 
you didn't know, we're making bonds, aren't we? So, with this, <laughs> well, I do the rest of the mixing. So, Make him with, the cloud, <laughs> with the cloud Play-Doh, you're just really wanting to mix it all up till you get, you know, a combined sort of texture. You might need to add in some extra corn flour or some extra conditioner. You'll just sort of know whenever the texture's right with it. It'll sort of come together like, like Play-Doh, but it'll also have a bit of a wet texture to it. So I actually think this is a wee bit too wet, this one. So we're actually going to add a bit more corn flour to the mixture. Because you want it to sort of, you want it to bang together. Yeah. Add a wee bit more. And also if you add too much corn flour, the same again, you just add another wee bit of uh, conditioner. I think we're nearly ready to get this out and have fun with it. Yeah, and make so, buns. We're ready to make buns So too. playing with the cloud dough is really great because it enhances the little one's fine motor skills. And um, it strengthens their hand muscles and their finger muscles. And it's great for their hand-eye coordination we as well. Don't forget we're making buns. And we're making buns. I think I might be need a little bit more conditioning in this one. Bone cases actually, we didn't bring them out. No. Do you want to go get them? They're in the bottom drawer okay. in the kitchen. Okay. The wee small ones, the wee coloured ones. Okay. So, as I was saying, it develops lots of things, um, and also it's great for developing the little ones imaginative and creative play. So, we're going to have lots of fun playing. It's all about playing and having fun through play with this and um, experimenting with the cloud play-doh um, with different toys so you can actually use just whatever toys you have in the house can everybody see that how it's sort of bound together yes brilliant we've got more and it's also great for it's, it's a real nice common effect and it's great for sensory play as well so it's got lots of benefits so we're gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna scoop it out we like using this Scooping. And I'm going to knead it together so you would knead it like normal Play Doh. I'm going to find my way, please. Oh, I'm not finished yet, darling. You just wait a wee minute. Because I always sit down, you know. Yes, yeah, so you can sit here once I finish kneading it and once it's all ready. But don't we have to get all ready first before we have lots of fun with it? Do a warm up. Yeah, okay. exercise our hands. Exercise. So, I'm going to like need it, we actually need a bit more, for some reason this is very wet today this one, get a wee bit more, so you're just going to knead it together like you would, you would normal play-doh, okay, and it will eventually become very dry, which spoon would you like? This one? Yes. Here we go. So Mommy, you can do this on any surface. Me. It's okay. It's fine. You can do this on any surface. We have this plastic sheet out and then I've obviously got the big tough tray that we use in classes. Um, but you could just use it on kitchen table anywhere. It is just corn flour and conditioner as I say. So it, it's really easy to wash off. It's not going to stain anything. So, as you can see, the texture is awful like Play-Doh. Well, I am. I'm going to make some buns already. But the consistency is like glue. Only, it's a there's a little more holding in it. So it just stays together a bit better than glue. So, it's super soft to play with. <laughs> and it just smells really good 
I still think this one needs a bit more um, corn flour. Do you not think it's very runny, this one? Mm, Let's add a wee bit more. Yeah. So, if you're making this at home, everybody, all the little ones and the mummies and daddies, if you're making this at home, just play about with it until you get it to the consistency that you want. So, it's your, don't forget, it's your cloud dough. So you can just make it whatever way you want. So you can see the change in it here now. The way it's sort of formed into more firmer texture. Let's put another wee bit here. So what colour is this that we've made? Pink. We've made a lovely pink cloud dough. That's so much fun. I love this. Mummy, we're making buns, don't forget. Yes, we're making buns, don't forget. So Obviously all our little learners classes are on hold at the minute with everything going on but it doesn't mean to say you can't have lots of fun at home. So little learners and all the franchisees together are going to be bringing these fun activities every weekday. So I hope you've enjoyed today but we're not done yet. We're only getting started aren't we? But if you've enjoyed today you can see us tomorrow as well. This is going in my hands. Look how messy this is. <laughs> Look how much fun this is. It's a very unusual texture to explain, but until you make it, you'll know what I mean. It's sort of like a wet and dry texture at the same time. And it actually just should come off your hands really easy. Right, so what are we making today then? Buns. So we're making buns. Okay, so you can just get all your toys out in the house. So whatever your little one's favourite toys are, whether it be some animals or some figures or some cars. We have everything. Don't we have everything here at Little Learners? Yeah. All different toys to play with. Yeah, and new learners <coughs> too. I mean our whole house. Our whole house. friendly ones but if you're watching your little one you may just be careful obviously with scissors or you can use a knife so what we'll do is we will roll it up and we'll make a cake oh look at that cake mommy i will wash my hands here you can use this if you want i will wash my hands okay you ready to wash your hands mm -hmm. so you can just use an ordinary plastic knife and you can Cut it into pieces, so we're going to slice this cake up. And there we go, we have a lovely bit of cake. Mm. And we can, what else can we do? We can use our scrapers. We use these in class. And again, you can push with this. You can make shapes in it. Or you can cut it all up into pieces. Do that and make it all messy. And then the great thing about this is that it just comes back into shape again, so you just push it all up together and you can start again with it. Now <coughs> it will eventually dry out because it's corn flour. And if any of you <coughs> excuse me, if any of you have been to our little learners classes, we absolutely love glue at class. Um, and that was on last week. Um, we made glue last week. I mean, why would we? And yeah, so it'll eventually dry out. So if you Mommy, want to add, <laughs> wow, look at this. Mummy, don't forget, we're making cake. We're making cake. So you get the cake. 
cake cases out and we'll make some cake now. You get give me pass me a couple of um cupcake cases. Here we go. Okay, so we've got a an orange one. I can make it. I have a blue one. I have a blue one. The yellow one. So we will roll some balls. So you can just do whatever you want with the green one. Hope you're still having lots of fun. Do you want to sit here? Yeah. Okay. We'll swap places. Yeah. Can I the Oh, we're going to get it everywhere. Can you move around quick? Oh. <laughs> right. So, we're making buns, so we'll just roll up wee bits here. There. Can you make a bun, cupcake? So, as I mentioned, you can just use any toys you have in the house. And you can just use your, your imagination and get creative. I hope everybody's having lots of fun. Yeah. And again, all the little learners, Belfast and North yeah, Bay, and all the little learners across yeah, the UK. Sure. Don't forget to give us a like and a love. And we um, are actually now on YouTube, so it would be great if you could follow us on YouTube. So if you just go to YouTube and then it's Little Learners UK and subscribe to us on YouTube. And you can get catch up on all these videos we're doing for our activities when we're in lockdown. So um hope you're having lots of fun. Evan's just awake. Uh, hello Evan. Is the is it up? Can you see Can me? Can I can have some more bun cases, please? Oh, yeah. So um oh more bun cases. So we we actually got this out the other day. So it's a really good activity to just play with for a good hour, a good long time, for however long you want, really. So, I'm just thinking, is there anything else? What else will we show? <gasps> Cars, that's right. So we can put this out. If you can see, okay. Oh, wow. Right, we will roll it out and roll it in. Just roll it out. And then we can use cars and make car tracks. Look at that. Back and forth. Straight lines. Side to side. Straight lines. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? And then we've got these wee stampers too. So we can stamp out and make some shapes. And look at my cupcake. Oh, I love your cupcake. What's it taste like? Have you tried it yet? No. It smells lovely. Smells lovely, does it? Mmm, it's lovely and coconutty. So you've all we've all these wee stampers. Yeah. You can also just use a fork and you can make different patterns and shapes. Look at that. Crisscross. Applesauce. <laughs> Crisscross applesauce. <laughs> so that looks well, doesn't it? And then we can we've also got these like that we use for our thread and they're just like wee shapes. You can also just pop them inside, pop it around it. You can just do anything, use anything in the house that you have laying about, just to have some fun. And you can even just get lots of things from but your kitchen your, cupboards. But not your teddy bear. No, not your teddy bear. But no. Well, you wouldn't want your teddy bear to get all messy. With, yeah. Well, you could, but your teddy bear then would have to go in the wash, wouldn't he? Yeah. Yeah. But it's okay. We can wash all this stuff after. It's easy washed off. As I say, corn flour. Mm -hmm. It does look very messy, but it actually isn't that messy. It's really easy to clean up. Um. Well, to an extent. So we've got this masher as well. So we can also mash, mash, can't we? And this strengthens our muscles and our arms and develops our hand or eye coordination as well. So we focus on what we're doing, and then we push down. Oh. It's good muscle, a good exercise for my muscles, eh? So we need some more bun cases. More bun cases. I think we're gonna say bye bye to everybody, but that doesn't mean that doesn't mean to say we're saying bye bye to this. We can still play with this, will we? So hope everybody's enjoyed today. We've really enjoyed it, haven't we? We had lots of fun, and thanks for for watching. And we hope that you are enjoying 
all these activities, the little learners is going to be brilliant. And we have, who do we have tomorrow? Let me see. We have Alicia. Mummy. And she's. Can you make a ball, please? A ball? Yep, I'll make a ball. We've got Alicia, and she is going to be bringing some sentry bags. So I'm really excited to see what that's like. So it'll be good fun. So don't forget to tune in tomorrow, same time, 10 o'clock, on the Little Learners UK um, Facebook page. And we'll be bringing some sensory, bo sensory bags with Alicia. Okay, so thank you everybody for tuning in today and watching. And if you missed us live, you can always catch up again, as I say, on the Little Learners UK Facebook page or our YouTube page. Okay, we'll see you soon. I'm going to say bye. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. Bye. Bye 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 bye.